Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix your wireless signal and Wi-Fi issues on your Amazon Fire Stick, as well as fix some of the buffering and streaming issues that you've been having. So let's jump into the tutorial right now on Your6 Studios. Start off, we need to do a complete restart of our Amazon Fire Stick and our wireless router. So let's go ahead and do those now. Now locate your Amazon Fire Stick and find where it's plugged into the power source and unplug it. And unplug it for 30 seconds and then plug it back in. And locate your Amazon Fire Stick as well and unplug it from the back of the TV and unplug it for 30 seconds and plug it back in. Do this at the same time as you unplug your power source. And if you are not getting a good reception with your Amazon Fire Stick, look how your Amazon Fire Stick is behind this TV. This TV actually is blocking a lot of your Wi-Fi signals from reaching your Amazon Fire Stick. So make sure when you're putting it behind your TV, there's a good reception. A good solution would be to maybe face your Amazon Fire Stick in the direction of your router and not have it behind your TV. So think about the situation of your room and how to reorganize everything and make sure your Amazon Fire Stick is close enough to your wireless router to have a good signal or a very good signal. If it's only fair on your Amazon Fire Stick settings, you'll probably have streaming and buffering issues. Also another thing that will dampen the strength of your Wi-Fi signal on your Amazon Fire Stick is the Wi-Fi signals going through all these different walls and floors that you have in your house. So be thinking about those, where you place your modem and your Amazon Fire Stick in your house, whether or not they're going through a lot of floors or even walls. Now locate your wireless router or modem and unplug it from the back. There will be a power cord. Go ahead and unplug it and then plug it back in approximately 30 seconds later. So now our entire network is restarting and this will alleviate most of the wireless signal issues you've been having with your Amazon Fire Stick. So our Amazon Fire Stick has been completely reset, our wireless router and our network has been completely reset. Let's jump on to our Amazon Fire Stick and go into the settings and look at more specific network options and look at the applications running in the background. Okay, now I'm on my Amazon Fire Stick. On the home menu, go ahead and scroll over to settings. And then go down and scroll over to network. And now we're going to go ahead and check to make sure we are connected to our wireless network. Mine is we are all a part of the matrix and I'm connected. Now press the play button over the network. And this will bring you to this page and you can see you're connected to your Wi-Fi. Your signal strength is good, very good or fair in your channel. Mine is number one and I'm connected to the internet. So this is very good for me. Make sure it's good or very good. If it's fair, go ahead and rearrange your Amazon Fire Stick so it's closer to your router. Go back to the home menu of your Amazon Fire Stick and scroll all the way to the top and go over to the left and go to this search bar and just say background processes. And this application right now will pop up background apps and processes. Let's go ahead and select this app. The great thing about this application is it will show you all the applications that are running in the background on your Amazon Fire Stick. So right now I have YouTube VLC player and this other YouTube application that are running in the background. And this will slow down your Amazon Fire Stick. And if it's using data in the background, that's going to slow down your streams or even cause buffering on your Amazon Fire Stick. So let's go ahead and close these applications down in the background by going to force close, then back out, and then go to the next application, go to force close, go to the next application, and finally go to this last application and go to force stop. And speaking of things running in the background, go back to your home screen on your Amazon Fire Stick and scroll back over to settings, and then go down, and then scroll to preferences, and then go down to data monitoring, and turn this off. Amazon is collecting information about you when you're using your device. And this is using data in the background, slowing down your streaming. Then go down to notification settings. And then go down to app notifications. 
and try and turn most of these application notifications to the off setting. So they're not interrupting your streaming. So turn most of these off. Also, another application you want to get is VLC player from your Amazon Fire Stick store. So go ahead and get this application, go all the way back up and go over to the left and just say VLC for fire. Now the great thing about this VLC player, instead of using like a MX player, this uses less data and it uses less CPU memory on your Amazon Fire Stick. So at any point in time, you're using some application that requires a media player, try to choose VLC player. It will use less data and use less memory in the background. If this video on how to fix the streaming issues, wireless signal, and Wi-Fi issues on your Amazon Fire Stick helped you out, make sure to leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more Amazon Fire Stick help videos coming up next on your six studios.